We're late, late, late. We have 20, maximum 22 minutes for your royal fitting. And then it's move, move, move to your speech at the Historical Society. After that, we have to rush, and I mean rush, to the Horticultural Society D. And then there's your math lessons, uh, your geography lessons, your science lessons. All my life I've always wanted to have one day just for me. Nothing to do and for once know where I need to be. With no lessons, lords, or lunches, or to-do list in the way. No one to say when to eat, or read, or leave, or stay. My life I've always wanted to have one day for myself. Not waking up with a pile of work on every shelf. With no hems in need of pressing and no sleeves in disarray. No wedding gown with a thousand stitches to crochet. And no debt to pay. Madam Carp, what do you think I'm running here? A cabaret? I would have said a debtor's prison. Keep laughing. You'll be working for me for another 37 years. But I've already paid off more than half. But there's an interest, isn't there? Your parents should have thought of that before they borrowed so much. They did it to feed me. Their mistake. <laughs> what would it be like to be? What would it be like to be? Sorry, my darling, but as you know, it is vital you marry King Dominic. It is the only way to take care of our people. I know. It's my duty. Oh, and look! Another engagement gift! You would think that I'm so lucky, that I have so many things. I'm realizing that every present comes with strings. Though I know I have so little, my determination's strong. People will gather around the world to hear my song. Can I come along? Now I fear I'll never be. Flight, but would it be right? My conscience tells me stay. I'll remain forever royal. I'll repay my parents' debt. Duty means doing nothing. Your heart may well regret, but I'll never stop believing. She can never stop my schemes. There's more to living than gloves and gowns and threads. 